Hey, you hungry? I am. I'm gonna make some pasta. But before we get into that, like and subscribe to the channel and let's get into it. Chrissy, say hey. Hey. All right, guys. So here we go with some veggies. We got that garlic in that container as my Cajun seasoning, my bacon, my mushrooms. Let's stand that butter. This Cajun pasta is finna be on point. We got this shrimp. I season it just with some simple salt and pepper because that Cajun seasoning gonna be on it. I got some seasoned chicken. It's already cooked, it's shredded, that we're gonna add in the pasta also. But you can put in any meats that you want. I went ahead and I cooked the pasta, but make sure you save you some pasta water. All right, you need some whipping cream for this Alfredo sauce. See the pasta? Okay, we got some Parmesan cheese. You can also add some mozzarella cheese if you would like. So here's the veggies. Once again, with that bacon, you gotta have some bacon, all right? Bacon is always good. All right, so we're gonna saute these shrimp up real quick, like. We don't take shrimp long to cook at all. See, see how fast I was? <laughs> Super fast. And stir it up, saute it if you want. You know, cook it till it's a little brown, but you don't want your shrimp to be overcooked because then it get like rubbery. So I went ahead and sauteed my bacon with my onions and my bell pepper. I went ahead and added my cream cheese. Not cream cheese. I went ahead and had it, added my heavy cream. I also added some good old milk to it as well. So now right here, I'm adding my Cajun seasoning and some salt. You do need to add your little bit of salt. That salt is what helps bring that flavor out. So we go ahead and mix it up, mix it up, mix it up, and wait until it comes to a boil. A boil helps your <clears throat> Alfredo sauce get thick with that heavy cream. That heavy cream helps that thickening of your sauce, okay? So make sure you have, I had it on high. So you can have it on medium heat, it's just gonna take a little longer. So you see how it's bubbling, looking all good and all nice. So I'm adding my mushrooms in there now. You still have your um, temperature on high, but like I said, you can have it on medium. Stir it up, stir it up. You see it's starting to thicken up a little more. Now we're going to start to add some of that cheese. And cheese also helps thicken it up. But that, that it, it's just something about cheese and Alfredo sauce. It, it just takes it over the top. You see that? Still not as thick as I want, so I'm going to cook it a little longer to get it that thickness that I want. You can't have no thin Alfredo sauce, okay? All right, so I'm going to add some Cajun seasoning. Stir it up. You see how thick it's getting? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Man, that looks so good. So we're gonna have to go ahead and add our cooked shrimp. And we're gonna have add our chicken. I don't know what it is, but it seems like I can't talk today. Like I really can't talk. So go ahead and mix that up. See how thick that is? Oh, that looks so good. Okay. Alright, so I cooked it down a little more and I added some more Cajun seasoning. But as you can see, I'm adding some of that pasta water because it was um, just like too thick for me. But delicious so now i'm adding the noodles the spaghetti noodles mixing that up and listen bam there it is i tried to be a little fancy by adding that parsley on there and putting some shredded cheese on top oh it's all nice and thick you see how that pasta is like hanging on oh that's my baby food right there i ain't want to give her an occasion but here we go that cajun shrimp and chicken pasta 